Hey guys, this is Mugatu. Today I'm going to try and pick for you this uh, Southern Steel Mogul format. It's got an S exclusive keyway. So we've got a S a twin core with barrels, drivers, and a matching counter milling. We've got the sidebar with the five side pins and false gates. Everything's being operated with this uh, nasty key. It's got a super bidding. It works great. And compare it to some regular lock. It's a medical large format interchangeable and you can see next to the Mogo uh, comparison is quite uh, speaks for itself. So I will try to give this a go on camera. Given the keyway and the bidding, I have to use this uh, hook and try to go down the side pin passage and scoop over the shelf to pick it without disturbing the fifth one. Uh, with barrels, it's been proven like a, to be a, quite a pain, but uh, I'll hopefully be able to get that on camera. I did manage to open this one once, and I'm hoping to repeat the exploit. Right. We're getting somewhere. Just let me check the side pins first. Still loose. But we've got the front row of the top pins binding, so we're on the good way. I'll have to check on the sixth one again. I did 
did get a tiny click. Four, three, two, one. It's hard to get under the fifth one and make sure it's set without every, oversetting everything. Mm -hmm. Did get a click, but was it a click of the pick passing or the set the pin setting? The front row looks happy. Oh, we're still lacking something. I think it's the fifth one. So. All right. Oh, I think that's good. I think that's good. One, two. No, still not. Did give the impression of a little, little bit more core movement. It's gotta be the sixth one. That's my that's the stubborn one in this lock. Got some more clicks. Getting very close, but it's not quite set up again. It's still stuck. First one I dropped some stuff so uh, that was more convincing. Still something holding us. Sure, that's the fifth. That's either the fifth or the sixth one. Try with the fifth. Oh, yep. Yeah. Get a, get a click here. Four, three, two. And one's a treacherous one because if you press just a little bit too much on it, it drops the other one. Come on, number six. It's gotta be you then. Ah, had to release some tension. Three, two, 
one. Yes, we've got ourselves a binding sidebar. get stuck. Getting close. One, two, three, four. Keep getting those little clicks. And eventually it'll just. The tension bar is gonna fly out my hand. Flags aren't the, 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 the tools that pickers like the most for those sidebars, but I found that it worked fine with this one. Come on. Then get a pulse with tension also. Just help that sidebar get in. There we go. Gonna finish that rotation, and we've got an open. Whew. Yeah, that's cool. Just gonna get out some tools to it. Got this boy. Well, setting the top was a bit longer than I was expecting, but the sidebar was. Uh, went pretty well so it is possible to defeat these prison locks pretty cool eh so let me just lock it back up for you and let's get to gutting So you have these two flat screws that's holding the cam. This is just an extra spacing part. It's just hiding away the uh, regular plug. Not a good power. Try and not make a mess of this. That fall room won't work, it's too big. Let's go with this one. So we have here the pin, sidebar, the side pins, and can we focus on, yep, get the teeth in the side pin, uh, the side pin in the sidebar. Try to remove the key without dropping everything. This again is a drill protection, so it's an extra plate that's uh, slid on. And, uh, 
seven, two, three, four, five. I forgot the sidebar springs. Whoa, man. That one just went flying. I can see it. Come on. Yes. Six. And as you can see, we do have that matching counter milling for uh, all six chambers. No modification done to the plug, but you can see that keyway. Uh, that's a nasty warding. That, that little piece just makes everything more hard. They can give you a sight. Barrel one. Barrel two. Barrel three. Barrel four, and barrel six, got it. All of them. Let me try to rearrange something. That's more like it. So I will give you a close up of all these parts. You have the uh, lock body, got the sidebar groove here. Very beefy piece. Uh, you can also get it via this um, this rod here. It's got a flat screwdriver uh, part. You just unscrew it and it pulls out. And you can see it down this hole. Uh, that'll just make it able to get it via the top. It's not the easiest to put back together. You have to push down the spring uh, and make sure the rod doesn't squeeze those springs. So I just rather got it the standard way. Um, the back piece, just to fit with the whole format. And let's get a close up of these parts. So we have six barrels pool drivers. Uh, with the matching counter milling for the plug. You then have the uh, five side pins with uh, those nasty false gates. And this one acted a little bit like a tapered, uh, like tapered pins. Uh, you really had to wiggle a bit tension and uh, keep tapping under them repeatedly with your pick boop, 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 for them to set progressively but slowly and surely. And that what's, uh, that's what got the open. So, that's about it for the uh, Southern Steel Mogul Asa exclusive. Pretty glad to have this one checked out of my uh, bucket list. And I hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching.